Well, here we are. Hawkins Mansion. The place has been abandoned since the fire. There's only old Winchester in his hut. <laughs> He's clearly not doing any gardening. You know, Silas Winchester has been working for the Hawkins family as far back as I can remember. Charles was like a son to him. The day of the fire, he lost his whole family. So he's got nowhere to go. And... As you'll see, in a way, he's still watching over them. Is there anything else you want to ask me? Or do you want to go up there? You're the one who looked after the Hawkins case. Don't think I was trying to hide it. It's just that this discovery shakes my convictions. That's why you're so keen to find out who removed the painting from the mansion. Yes. If something escaped us, or... If there's been a law enforcement error, then it's up to the police to make good its mistake. Anything else? Night falls quickly here, and I want to be able to see when we arrive. I'll go with you, if only to reassure Silas. Why not? You can help. Right. Let's go. Recently fallen. It's as if all life has abandoned the place. Sixteen ninety three. This house is much older than it seems. Poor kid. Poor kid. Someone must really hate Charles Hawkins. I told you. Silas Winchester is still watching over the Hawkins family. I must say, it's pretty gloomy. So, Detective, does this place inspire any thoughts? Do you know if Charles Hawkins had any enemies? Not to our knowledge. He was a well-respected personality on the island. I don't understand. Silas would never have let such a thing happen. Why were they buried here? I was given to believe that it was Charles Hawkins' wish. Strange idea. I imagine Webster wasn't too pleased. Mrs. Hawkins' father? said that he's devastated. Let's go to the mansion. Please give me a minute. I didn't expect to set foot back here after the burial. What kind of deranged individual would defile this sanctuary and steal a burnt painting? I don't see Silas doing such a thing, let alone allowing it. Even that broad baker is above that. Lord, have pity on this poor family. The flowers on Sarah Hawkins' grave are fresh.
I'll have to find another entrance. This entrance is still in use. Whoa! Whoa! You are trying to force the door, you nosy prick! Easy, sir, all right? Put down the axe. You know what we do with rubble like you? We gut them. Dump them into the ocean. Whoa! Uh, uh, uh. You're... Mr. Winchester, lower that axe, and let's talk calmly. I'll show you how we have it out on dark water. You haven't forgiven yourself. You stay here to honor the memory of the deceased. That's true. I want no more violence, no more tragedy. It's painful to be the last one left. You don't know how right you are. Understood. I'm listening. The police report describes a domestic accident. But Stephen Webster has several reasons to believe that this may not be the case. Webster is as stubborn as an old mule. And I did tell him that we should let the dead rest in peace. He wants to restore the reputation of his daughter. I just need to see where the fire started. No, I can't let you in. The mansion isn't safe. That's why you barricaded the entrance. That's right. And this door? It's locked, and I make sure it stays that way. No one lives in the mansion, and you don't take care of it anymore. If you have a good reason to be here, I'm listening. There's vermin. I keep an eye out. Vermin. Yeah, that's it. Vermin. Right. This is what we're going to do. I go inside, and I promise that I'll hunt vermin. Okay with you? Mm, I'm not sure. If there's nothing else to fear, you can give me that key. Uh, right. Take the key and do what you have to do. Go on, then. Just to get rid of you. Let's see what more I can learn from this mansion. This gate is locked. Poor wretch seems to spend the best part of his time isolated from the world. I know a thing or two about solitude myself. Rather Spartan, the caretaker has simple tastes.
Pierce, shall we enter? Now that you've finished your fun and games with Silas, we can perhaps inspect the mansion. You're right. Let's go. Let's take a look inside. I'm with you. Follow me. I know the place. Who left this light on? The Last Supper of the Hawkins. What does this tell me? What kind of meat is this? This place is for the head of the family, Charles Hawkins. The boy was probably here. Smashed his plate on the floor. Sarah Hawkins' plate. Why did she leave it untouched? Something happened at this table. An argument? Working, officer. This dinner table tells us a lot about the Hawkins family life. Well, we don't have all day. The scene of the fire is next door. Silas managed to bring the fire under control. But it was already too late for the Hawkins. They seem happy. But Charles is already looking off into the future. His marriage just a stop along the way. Was Charles Hawkins some kind of explorer? Too much rubble. I'll find an easier way. Let's see if I can find something the cops missed. Was Charles Hawkins a heavy drinker? The child's corpse left a trace. Where are the others? They had a fight. Why?
If the painting I found on the docks really came from here, how come it didn't burn? stop at the time of the fire. Did Sarah Hawkins lose one of her shoes? How? Did someone escape the fire? Blood. This lamp was thrown. This was no accident. This was a fight. Someone fell here. A desperate attempt to flee. So, Detective, what do you make of it? I firmly believe this fire was more than just an accident. Huh. What's your theory? I think the Hawkins couple got into a fight. You sure of that? There's only one way to be sure. I just ask that you don't disturb anything. If Chief West found out about what we're doing, I'd be in serious trouble. This door is locked. These bandages are covered in dried blood. The same bandages that I saw in the warehouse on the docks. And given the blood stains, I'd also say that it's the same person. The lyrics of the drunken sailor, the sea shanty. This door is blocked from the outside. An original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, dated 1818. Moby Dick, Melville's classic, the epic battle between man and whale.
Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess. There's something disturbing about this painting. There's something disturbing about this painting. 20,000 leagues under the sea. Another story about the mysteries of the deep. Book on hunting whales, the island's staple diet last century. Dark water history. This place was settled back in 1692 by two families that seceded from the New England colonies. Greek mythology. Hecate, goddess of the dead, daughter of Tartarus, and mother of Scylla. What could Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police? Locked. The boys' room. A child's fort. From what threat was Simon protecting his world? Tom Sawyer, Mark Twain. Sarah must have read it to him before bed. Sleeping pills. Strong for an 11-year-old boy. What was wrong with this family? What nightmarish vision could have inspired them? Simon's troubles went beyond family problems. That kid saw something. Something terrified him. What will her room reveal about her? Barbiturates. Sarah Hawkins must have been extremely agitated resorting to such a treatment.
This padlock is too complicated for me. It's no use. The padlock won't give. Was Sarah Hawkins interested in the occult? What was she trying to achieve? The door is blocked on the other side. Despite what happened, they seem to have loved each other. This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. It seems the last one was given for free to a Francis Sanders. I wonder why. Sarah Hawkins' agent was getting worried. Seems she wasn't giving any signs of life. Bradley? Is that you? Is anyone there? Bradley, did you see which way he went? Who? I didn't see anyone. I just heard some noise. Are you all right? A man was hiding on the upper level. He ran when he saw me. He can't be far. <sighs> this door is blocked from the outside. I'll cover you. This door was closed earlier. Where did he go? It looks like an old seaway map. Do you really think that your fugitive came in here? I don't see any way out. Have you seen the old maritime maps on Charles Hawkins' desk? Strange. No ship has left Darkwater shore for years. Maybe he kept them for sentimental reasons. Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. A 
I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another friend of Hawkins. The Scylla. It's the boat that was stranded at the entrance to the harbor. This panel is movable. Cogwheels. They must be linked to an opening mechanism. Probably a secret passage. I must find a way to activate the opening mechanism. I'd be better off not touching them for the moment. As if the bookcase has been moved several times. Seems like this came from a log. There must be a link with the Seaway map. This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. Looks like it worked. Well done, Pierce. Secret passage, under the manor. It's like a detective novel. That guy must have already gotten far. Yeah. And he had a direct means of entry to the crime scene. We must find him. What is this place? Three seats. Look. Someone's been here recently. Did Charles Hawkins use this place? Who were the others? What is this mask supposed to represent? Did Charles Hawkins hide something in this chest? This piece of cloth is unmistakably from a dress. Was Sarah Hawkins here? This padlock is too complicated for me. Of course. And something tells me that the key is climbing these steps. There's tunnels all over this island. Given the size of this cave, there's got to be other entrances. The passage continues further down. Might as well start with that. I ain't gonna squeeze in there. I'll find another way. If possible, I prefer not to ruin my uniform. Fine, fine. Go look for another entrance. I'll try my luck down below.
Some kind of dream catcher. If I touch it, it'll turn to dust. A sad way to go. An old diary. A sad way to go. These paintings must be several centuries old. These people lying down. Are they dead? Are they asleep? This monstrous creature must be an allegory. These buildings seem to have come out of the water. Time has weakened these structures. I don't have time to search them all. It looks like animal oil, but certainly not whale. What's going on here? Piers! Keep your voice down. We're not alone. Oh God. What have you got me into? We'll see. I'll go on. Try to go down on your side. Yeah, th there's a passage. I'll meet you at the bottom. Table for sacrifice? A mass grave. I got it. Look, 
I can't breathe. What's happening? No, damn it! I must find a way out of here. Is it my turn? Yes. It is time. You will soon be one of us. If your body and mind are ready. I dream of it every night. I have constant visions. I am ready. Good enough. Prove it to us. It's like in my dream. 